everyone, I'm Jiaxin. I'm now at Zhou Chen Satellite Launch Center. It's the earliest and largest launch center for satellites and missiles, and every manned spacecraft has been launched from here. In the middle of the square, there is a white sculpture called the Light of the Silver Lotus, probably because of its overall shape. And it also looks like two hands holding one satellite. I think it expresses the joint efforts between technicians, scientists, and astronauts behind each mission. It reads China Dream, Space Dream, and every successful launch is announced here. This park is called Feitian Park or Flying Park. Those who's ever made it to the launch center will come to this park. The most eye-catching objects are the models of missiles and rockets. This is an exact model of the Dongfeng Two missile, which has a maximum range of 1,500 kilometers. Huang Ge, 1,500 km. 1,500 km, almost a drive of 14 hours. Wow, so far. The missile was the first nuclear ballistic missile China tested in 1966. The other model is a carrier rocket named the Feng Bao One or Storm One. On September the 20th, 1981, China successfully launched the three satellites using the Storm One. The feat made China the third country in the world that can carry multiple satellites using one single rocket. And these satellites are all planned by Chinese astronauts. For example, the first Chinese astronaut Yang Liwei and the first female astronaut Liu Yang. This tree is planted by Jing Haipeng and Chen Dong, who took the Shenzhou 11 craft back in 2016. And a new manned mission could bring new life to the area.